This is array 1, the problem is front 1, 1, and the problem reads, given two integer arrays, a and b, of any length, return a new array with the first element of each array. If either array is length 0, ignore that array. So for the first example, the output is 1 and 7 because 1 is the first element of array A and 7 is the first element of array B. Now for the last example, the output is just 1 because the array B does not contain any elements. So for this problem, I'm going to create a couple of if statements. So first we're going to check if both the lengths of A and B are 0. In that case, we will just simply return A. Now, um, we're going to check if A dot length is zero. So if only A does not contain anything, then we're going to create an integer array called my array. and set that to include b at 0. And we will return my array. And then we will check for if only the length of b is 0. And in that case, we will create an integer my array and set that to hold only a at zero and then we will return my array and if none of these cases are true then we will get to this part where we will create my array once more and have it hold a at zero and b at zero. Then we will return my array.